Hello everyone. In our previous lesson, we understood what is pH and that low pH means high hydronium ion concentration in solution. High pH means low hydronium concentration in the solution and you know this pH really matters. So what is the importance of pH in everyday life? You know the pH of blood and pure water is around 7.4. Our body works within the pH range of 7.0 to 7.8. Living organisms can survive only a narrow range of pH change and that is why acid rain is so threatening. The pH of acid rain is below 5.6. When this acid rain flows into river, it lowers the pH of water. Low pH is very bad for aquatic life. Not only can a low pH kill living fish, but also it can prevent fish eggs from hatching at all. So you can see, low pH can hamper aquatic life. The plants also require specific pH for good growth. pH between 5.5 to 7 is best for the growth of plants. In human beings, stomach produces acid to lower the pH of food. Many enzymes require lower pH to function. The gastric juice secreted by stomach has hydrochloric acid that is HCl as its main constituent and it has a pH of about 1.2 and hence it is acidic. Now, too much acid actually irritates and also causes pain. We call it acidity. So, we use bases such as antacid to neutralize the acid. You know, the tooth decay starts when the pH of the mouth drops below 5.5. The tooth enamel is mostly made of calcium phosphate and the acid produced by bacteria can corrode it. pH below 5.5 means presence of acid. So we use toothpaste which is basic in nature and it increases the pH of the mouth. Many animals use acid for their self defense. For example, ant and bee sting injects formic acid. We use mild base like baking soda on the stung area for relief. The optimal pH of our skin is around 5.5. Use of regular soap too often increases pH as we know the regular soap is basic. When the pH of skin is high, the skin becomes drier and its defense against bacteria is weaker. So pH really matters in lots of things. That's all for now. Bye-bye.